In this video, I'm going to be talking about the Amazon Revenue Calculator, which is a free tool that you can use to help you determine whether or not a particular product can be sold on Amazon at a profit. Now, as an Amazon reseller, that's going to be very important to you for obvious reasons, mostly because you want to make sure that you are making money. It's a simple tool to use, so let's get right to it. This is what to sell on Amazon. I'm Horace. Let's go. Okay, guys, real quick, we're going to get into this video about the revenue calculator. It's very easy. Uh, what you can do to find that if you don't know where to get to it right from Google in the search box, you can just type in revenue calculator and you'll see it auto fill from there. And then from from there, you can find it looks just like this you'll click on it and there it is now the first thing you'll notice is that it says fulfillment by Amazon revenue calculator but once we get into it you'll see that you can you can figure out um, whether or not you can make a profit using Amazon FBA which is where you send the products into the warehouse and Amazon does the fulfill fulfillment for you or you can see how much it costs if you do a uh, merchant fulfilled meaning you're going to do the picking packing shipping tracking all that so let's go over to amazon and let's just pick a product um all right how about this this brita whatever those are selling for 19 <clears throat> Let's say you were able to get them for five dollars a piece. And yes, if you're wondering, deals like that are possible. If you want to know how to find deals like that, take advantage of the course. <clears throat> Jim, you can give them a quick screenshot of what that looks like. If you want to do that, just keep watching the videos. We talk about it on, on other ones. So the first thing you need to do is take the ASIN, which you can get that if you go down into the description you can get the ASIN right here most of the time when you watch my videos you will see me grabbing it from up here it always starts with a B0 or something like that you'll learn that as you go along if you don't know how to get to that you take that ASIN you stick it in the box you search and boom, there you have it. <clears throat> now, from here, you would put what it's selling for, assuming you're gonna jump in where they are, that would be $19.99. Uh, then you gotta put in, in this column, because this is the fulfillment by Amazon column. How much is it gonna cost you to ship the product into the Amazon warehouse? For me, that normally runs about 50 cents you'll learn approximately what it runs you as you as you move on with this in the beginning it might run you a dollar or so because you may you just may not have enough products that you're sending in the more products you send in the less it's going to cost you per unit now let's say it's going to cost five bucks for the product <clears throat> you calculate and here is what you would make um and that's not a lot, but this is just a demonstration to see how that would work. Uh, you see nothing on this side. This would be the side uh, if you were going to fulfill. Now let's let's go ahead and fill that out. Same price, nineteen ninety nine, and you're going to charge the customer say five bucks shipping. Here is what where you would enter information like what is it costing you to warehouse the products? Do you have some labor working or have you calculated your labor? What it costs you? How much is the packing materials? Uh, what is it going to cost you to ship to the customer? And have you calculated in customer service of some sort? Um, <clears throat> If you don't know what that is, and a lot of times you're not going to, you're starting out or whatever, you don't have all of this. So what you might just say is, hey, I don't know my detailed cost. 
and let's just say you figured okay eight bucks and we're just using that as an example then in that case if you were fulfilling it assuming this is approximately correct you would make eight dollars and 24 cents now of course I teach as many others teach to go fulfillment by Amazon and you start out and you're doing that and but ever so often you're looking at the competition the other sellers and you might say to yourself well why would someone want to fulfill themselves there are different reasons again I teach FBA but there are times where you may want to fulfill yourself what if you're the only person that's selling this item and they're selling do you want to make two dollars and 17 cents letting Amazon do it or do you want to make eight dollars and 24 cents and you got to do the work that's a decision you have to make how much is your time worth you know what I mean how many of these do you have you may want to make that money you got 10 of them well What's the difference between here? You're talking about an extra 60 bucks, maybe. You know what I'm saying? So, <clears throat> something else. Uh, let's see here. No, there was one other thing I was going to show you, but looks like they updated the, uh, the calculator. Another thing is your, your net profit margin. And you can see the difference. You got a, you got 10.36% versus 32.97. Again, I I teach FBA. It's just a better way to run it, especially if you're like me, you work, you don't have time. You want to try to minimize and actually let Amazon do the that type of work for you so that you can focus on the deals. But you look at these and you know your net margin that tells you what kind of profit you're making now personally I prefer to go with what's called ROI or return on investment you're either gonna go uh, you're either gonna go profit margin or you're going to go ROI depending on your business model I personally like to use ROI if you want to learn about that again we teach that in the course um, so guys that pretty much covers this this quick video um, if you have any questions just post it and I'll answer um, again it's pretty easy once you get going with it so that concludes this video Thanks, guys. So this concludes this video. I hope you got some value out of it. Also, please remember to give a thumbs up if you like the video. Also, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification so that you can be notified when we come out with new material. This is what to sell on Amazon. I'm Horace. I'm out. Chicken, chicken, chicken.